Hello, I'm Gabriel with West Palm Dogs and today I'm here with Baxter and we're working on his go to bed. So now that Baxter has it down, that progression would be go to bed. So what I've been doing with Baxter is the following. I've been throwing a piece of food, he gets it, I'm gonna say his name, Baxter. Gets attention and say, Baxter, go to bed. Yes, and I treat. I treat again, one more time. I tap on the head, that word okay, and now he's released. And that's very good for him. Ready? Go get it. So he gets it. I say his name, Baxter. Baxter, go to bed. Yes, and I treat. I treat again. One more time. Tap on the head, that word okay, and he's released. Now, what I'm gonna do is be standing up. And the reason is because some dogs, even this small change can affect them. So I want to I want Max to be able to do the command in any at any time at any moment no matter the circumstances. Baxter, <coughs> Baxter, go to bed. <coughs> so you can see he got a little bit slower. That's fine. I'm gonna help him out. Yes. <coughs> I tap on the head and release. So I'm gonna be I'm gonna start working that go to bed while I'm standing up. <coughs> Baxter. Baxter, go to bed. Yes, and there you go. Now he has it. So I'm gonna do one more and end it there. He's doing very good. Hey, ready? Go get it. He gets it. Baxter. Baxter, go to bed. Yes, treat. Treat again, one more time. Tap on the head, that would okay, and now he's released. And this was very good from Baxter. Now from here, what we're gonna be doing is adding that distance, adding distractions, and adding duration. But for now, this was very good. I like how he's getting comfortable on the mat, and he's just focused on me. That was very good from him. Nice job, buddy.